Hello friends. Hi, how are we today? I hope we're all doing well. I'm here. I am fantastic. I am finally coming with you, uh, at you with a haul. I've been waiting for one piece of mail to come. It is, um, end of November in Canada and Southern Ontario. So we are, um, what's the word I'm looking for? We are at the end, like, our mailing window, our shipping window for everything is starting to get like very, 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 very tight. Um, and they're taking quite a long time to ship things. So, um, I have, uh, quite a few different shops, uh, today and I've got some items, some planner items, uh, I don't normally have. Uh, so I thought I would jump right into it and, um, start off with my miscellaneous items because I think that's the way to go. And we're not even going like oldest to newest. Um, I'm just going to go from like top to bottom here um ending with sweet tea sticker go because i it's she's hefty it's a hefty 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 order <laughs> now some of this stuff has been sitting on my desk for quite some time and um i really want to get it off my desk and into storage and i found this at the dollar store and actually the only place in southern ontario that i've been able to find reliably the ultra fine sharpie pens is from the dollar store now i could go on amazon and spend an absolute fortune to get like a pack of 17 i don't really need those i typically go through like one of these a year maybe one of these every 15 months so two is just fine for me and i will put them into my storage but they are fantastic uh, i actually just ran out of ink on my last one uh, I use it all the time for my kids' labels and stuff, but I also use it uh, for specialty paper when other stuff doesn't fit. Um, and these ones are just the best Sharpies in the world, and I'll show you why in a second. Mm -hmm. So a regular Sharpie tip, um, let me just see what I have here. Um, is this my Ultra Fine? Yeah, this is my one that nearly recently fell out. But I'm just going to show it. I haven't opened these ones yet, so I don't really want to. But this is, like, very, very, very fine. You could use it as, like, a felt tip pen. And if you wanted to, you could just... It's probably, like, close to 0 0.7. Now, there is shadowing because it is a Sharpie. But they reliably write and there is no smudging. So I just went ahead and restocked on a couple of those. They're probably the planner item that I use the absolute most of, um, if we're going to be totally honest. And I love them. And I think that everyone should own at least a couple because they're just good pens to have. Next up is the paper block. Oh my God, I was so shocked by this. Um, I found it at the dollar store and I wasn't expecting something so small. Like I've never seen one so small before. And I thought, you know, on those weeks that I just have um, leftover sticker kits or I'm trying to do spreads with washi, these patterns are really nice. They're fairly simple. And I think like, I especially like this polka dot one. I just think this would look really nice in a spread and pretty easy to cut out. And I thought, you know, maybe if I am cutting out stickers, um, there's, there's no reason that I wouldn't be able to cut out some paper pads. Next up, we have our order from Simply Gilded. Now it isn't, well, it is an order, obviously you see it in front of you, but it isn't really an order. I, uh, won a giveaway and I won, um, I won, I think it was 40 US dollar shop credit. So it was enough to buy a couple of, um, packages of washi and then, uh, include shipping and everything. So I did not have to pay a cent because I believe it was 40 US dollars. Obviously the US dollar is stronger than the Canadian dollar. So worked out super well for me. Um, but I, I know it doesn't seem like I have a lot here, but I also got, um, one of the packages for my friend, Rachel. Um, she and I, you know, if you've been on the channel for a while, shout out to my OG Rachel. Um, she and I do Simply Gilded forever and um, I just thought I'd treat her. So I got two different colors of washi and I honestly, I'm so obsessed. So this is Poppy and it's like showing up very, very, very true to color on camera. I love it. And then this is called winter mist um w no winter frost frosted fur frosted fur i knew there was an alliteration there anyway let's just get into everything else that you get first so i'm loving these inverted um bow oh what 
How does that work? Bow uh, letter seals, I guess. Yeah, so it's, it's like clear. So it's really cool. Um, this is my second one I have of them, and I'm like kind of obsessed with them. Then the journaling card, which is so cute. I love the owl so much. Um, and then it came because I ordered um, in October. Did I order October or did I order November? I can't recall. It came so quick. This is from uh, Painted Pumpkins and it's a deco sheet and I'm already, I can already see what I want to do with it for next year for a leftover kit for Halloween. I love it. Um, what else did I get in here? Oh yes. Then I got the um, Sampler Freebie 24 and it's cute and it's got this cute little picture uh, video. I love them. I I'm going to deconstruct it from here and put it into my little sampler folder and uh, use the full box because I really love the Simply Gilded artwork and I feel like it's a good base to start a kit. Then I got, oh, another one of these. And I love them, as I said. And then she included the Simply uh, Free Gilded Freebie Sampler 2022. So this one was 2020, this is 2022. And it matches Poppy really, really, really well which is nice. And then last but not least, um, this beautiful stunning journaling card. And I just, I think I'm going to put this somewhere where I can, I just like it. I think it's the cutest thing in the world. Um, but what I will do on the back is I will show you, um, the frosted fur and poppy rolled out. And I will just do that on camera because why not? So this is frosted fur. And the reason that I roll these out for you guys is because they look, um, I don't know the lighting that Irene uses, but they look a lot different on, um, a piece of paper than they do, um, when they're on the roll. So that's frosted fur. Now it might look like something else that you have. You don't. Rachel and I have gone through and we compared every single blue that we have. And between the two of us, we have most blues that Irene has released. Nothing, nothing looks like this. Nothing looks like this. It is so stinking beautiful. Um, it's blue with like a gray green back. Like, I don't know how to describe it. Um, I'm really excited because on my viewfinder, at least, it's showing up as pretty true to color on camera, which is really exciting because when I was trying to show Rachel originally, it just wasn't showing up. But again, we've gone through every single one of our blues. There is not a single blue that is like this. And then Poppy, again, it's a different red. It, there's no red that is like this. Um, the other red that I have is, I believe, from the, what's it called? Um, oh, God, it's so vibrant. It's so, it's so beautiful. I love both of these so much. These were, like, the best things that I picked up. They're just stunning. I love them so much. So, um, if you've picked up Simply Gilded Washi recently, tell me which one is your favorite to pick up. Um, I'm not buying too much more. I think I've got a pretty good stash, but like, let me know if there's anything that I'm missing or if you wanted to see a Simply Gilded Washi walkthrough. I do have one on my channel previously, but I could absolutely do another one again. Just let me know, uh, in the comments down below. Next up is another freebie. Uh, and this is Sadie Stickers. Now, CD Stickers runs a deal that every single time she has her 2024 planner release, uh, for the first Friday of it, she will go ahead and you can order a kit to go along with your planner. So if you haven't seen my planner video, um, about my 2024 planner lineup and my setup, then absolutely go check that out. I will link that in the iCard probably right over there. So, um, I elected to get the, um, City Winter Kit, and let me just tell you, it is so beautiful. It's a foily kit. I love that the tops are cut off of these. It just makes it really easy for either storage or anything else, and, oh, it's so pretty. So, the quote says, because sometimes these can be hard to read on camera, in the depths of the winter, I finally learned that within me there lay an invincible summer. I don't love that with all my heart. You guys know I don't love, love, love the quote boxes, but like there are, I'll walk you through the kit format, obviously. So there are nine, ooh, did she change her matte paper? Ooh, it's pretty. So there are nine full boxes with beautiful foil detail on every single one of them. 
And then you've got three paint swatches that are sort of the size of third boxes here. Then on your next page, you have a very functional page of different size boxes. You've got the smaller little rectangles. You've got more paint swatches. You've got squares and some circles for layering. Layering stickers, um, I think, are still in. I don't know if they're still in as they were before. Um, I feel like we've a little bit moved away from that, but um, still, they're gorgeous. And um, some of them have foily detail on them which is really nice you don't have to add the extra foil then the next page is just I haven't also gone through this yet so like very exciting for me the next page you've got um beautiful cut foiled headers and decorative headers so these are scallop these are deco and then these are just your straight across headers uh you've got your sidebar and your little bow checklist you've got some journaling prompts or journaling torn pages that you can use there and more layering stickers this is just beautiful this is so cute, beautiful and then you can also this is a nice full box and you could add that in and then add your own quote box over top of that i've definitely seen that a bunch of times and actually, before we move on, I'm just going to take this opportunity to say I'm so sorry. I have been sick now for, um, between my kids and myself, it's December, or it's November 28th today. I've been sick for 10, 10 days. Um, this is the best that I've sounded in a while, so <laughs> I apologize, guys. Um, and then here is the, like, oh, look at this. I love a winter floral. And I like this, like, little copper wire I don't know detailing you just get some more divider headers here I love 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 let me see if I can do this this little scalloped divider bar so pretty so pretty and then you've got my favorite type which is paint oh no it's not it's just paint swatches but it's Monday through um, Sunday and you've got some cute little deco here I love that lamp post and that is the entire kit and that's gonna work perfectly for me I cannot wait to pull it into my planner I think January February it does feel like a January February kit and then there was a sampler that came with it this is uh, Tara's sampler you don't get 20% off but um, uh, the planners ever but it's she always includes a sampler so um this is so so beautiful and it's just different um mandelas and layering stickers with foil so that's gorgeous and that was my entire order um the freebie order that i got with sadie stickers as i mentioned before go ahead and check out the 2024 um uh, uh, planner lineup to see the full Sadie sticker planner. It's a, it's a true vertical neutral and it is wonderful. Actually, I'm so excited. This is from the Prey Planner and I ordered long before Black Friday. She had a flash sale on a Friday. I can't remember how much the discount was, but it was hefty, maybe 30%. It was really nice, but I, Ilza plans it, um, Ilza plans and melts it. I will link her in like just right over here um she um she had shown the artwork the digital artwork for this and I actually have a printable with the same artwork from a different shop and I love the color variation I might even use it twice I'm so excited for this order so let's just jump into it first things first you always get your freebies and this is the November freebie and I love that Stacy makes them all seasonal very nice then we have um this is danielle sampler oh my gosh how cute is that for christmas oh my gosh i love it like the advent calendar the music and then this is all seasonal as well look at that little starbucks cup i think uh of all the samplers and all the leftovers and all the freebies that i have i definitely pull in the prairie planner the most i find it the most functional and there's always something that represents like the season look at that snow covered parking meter like it's just perfect and she's changed up her loyalty program a little bit but essentially what you do is you get a coupon code when you finish up one of your loyalty cards and you get a black heart on your sampler and it goes on to here so i actually have um from a while ago um from the mini kits this is like my little sampler and like bean card and everything. But as you can see, I have a ton. So I'll just keep it and uh, keep that going and add that to the bunch. 
maybe because this is her old ones so I don't know if she's still honoring these ones either way I'll fill it out but I always add it with this and that's exciting and the reason for the season the kits that I got I'm not going to start with my favorite kit yet because that just seems foolish I am going to start with a Christmas kit so as you guys know I was using all of my stuff and I was like so proud of myself. I had been on a low spend. I haven't really been buying much. My hauls have been pretty small as you guys know. Well, lo and behold, I get to Christmas and I, well, I get to October and I don't have any Christmas kits and I get like, I don't have any November kits. I have been like pulling everything out of thin air. I'm like, what is going on here guys? So here we are. I had to buy a Christmas kit, uh, and you will see that I also bought some from Sweetie Sticker Co. as well, and I wanted to show it to you. So this is called Holiday Prep, and I just love that it wasn't, um, you know, pink and green or red and green. Uh, I never really see blue with Christmas. I do have a lot of people in my life who celebrate Hanukkah, so I do like bringing in blues as well. Um... But this is just so cute for Christmas prep, and I am, like, full-blown, full swing into Christmas prep in my house. This past weekend, we bought our Christmas tree. We do a live tree every single year. We got it decorated. We did our outdoor lights. We decorated around the house. And my big kid is three and a half now, and he really gets it. And he just loved every single second of helping. He thought it was the best thing in the world. So I am so glad that we were able to do this and I'm so glad that I have this um I am going to use this for oh I don't even know why I'm doing that I want to show you what is in the kit before we go on any further so first thing you get nine full boxes I love this double scene this is like what I want Christmas to look like in my life when I can afford a bigger house right now our house is pretty small but one day that's the dream uh and you get nine full boxes, and then I don't know if you guys know this, but up here there's two um, header-sized, like, decorative uh, headers, so that's really cool. I usually use them in the sidebar as dividers. Uh, and then I just get standard vertical because I have a 7 by 9 which is the Sadie Stickers Vertical Neutral, as I told you guys. And this is your very functional page. You get half boxes, third boxes, quarter boxes, decorative boxes, rounded boxes, all the boxes, and appointment labels. Then you have the bottom washi. Oh, look. And it's not even cut, so it's a big, thick chunk. Sometimes they're cut, sometimes they're not. But she is beautiful. It's matte. I work, I do everything on matte. And then you have your sidebar. You've got two bill dues and two habit trackers. And of course, your Monday through Sunday. Then the functional page galore. You have all of these functional icons. You've got a weekend. You've got flags. I love these. Uh, currently reading, currently watching movie and your heart checklist. And then on your last page of a standard vertical kit, you have your decorative headers. Ooh. Oh, I love this. So you guys know I don't love girls, but I do love an extra box. Oh, that's excellent. So I'd definitely replace the girl with this one. Oh, I'm so excited, guys. I haven't even gone through these yet, as you can tell. So I'm, I'm really excited. That's, um, that's good. And this is called Holiday Prep, and it's still in the shop. Uh, this should be going up on November 28th, by the way. If it's not, then it's going up November 29th, one of the days. Next up is called Frozen Pond. And as you guys know from being with me for a couple of years, every February, um, my family and I go to my mom's cabin up in a ski hill for a week and it is fantastic and we go skating and we do puzzles and it's cold and we eat a lot and uh we go to an outdoor fire pit like the whole shebang kit and caboodle this is like encapsulated in this kit so i love the color scheme i love the green um don't love the girls we'll see if she includes anything extra but that's okay because i also have a printable that i can like franken franken plan franken kit so really excited for this it's called frozen pond and it is the same format um and i just love the very very soft colors they are um not showing up quite as well on camera except for this green but you can believe me when I say, oh my gosh, look at the snow, look at the snow. Oh, I just want to live here forever. And let's see, is this all, go oh, no, look at this. So we don't have to have a girl. Look at that. That's so exciting. 
I'm really excited. So I can't play, wait to plan with this. This is going to be for February. It's going to be the week that we're up at the cabin, probably the week of family day weekend. So that's like the third Monday in February. So if you want a kit lineup, I hope you can see which way this is going, guys. So that was everything that I bought in a cheeky order from uh, the Prairie Planner. Finally, we have not one, but two Sweet Tea Sticker Co. orders. And when I tell you she's a big one, I mean she's a big one. I placed two separate orders because I missed something. Uh, I got a freebie that isn't available in the shop quite yet, so I can't wait to like sneaky peek it for you guys. And this was in lieu of the Black Friday sale. Christy is a ready-to-ship shop. So most things are printed and cut ahead of time, and she likes to do her sales before Black Friday just because obviously the market is pretty cornered on Black Friday. Things get pretty busy, but in Canada, as I said earlier in this video, shipping in Canada has been really slow already. So she does her Black Friday sale the first weekend in November. Now, a little birdie called the Made in Canada sale Instagram <laughs> told me she is also participating in the Black, uh, Boxing Day sale in Canada, so December 26th, with Made in Canada. So you can still pick up all of this uh, at a discounted rate, and then and um, it's still all in her shop right now. You guys know, and I've said it 18 trillion times before, Christie's shop is probably still one of the most reasonably priced shop just at regular price. And so when she does do her sales and when she does offer her discounts, I say like run and grab them because they are so um, steep, I guess, <laughs> uh, given what you get. Uh, and then for the November 3rd through 5th, I believe it was, uh, every time you ordered and you were part of the Facebook group, you get your own little vinyl, um, name. And so she just did mine. Uh, I let her choose the vinyl or yeah, the vinyl, and I will put that into my planner. I'm really excited. So let's just get into it. I ordered a lot. And as you can see, these aren't open. I wanted to show you guys the beautiful packaging that she has. It's just stunning. Um, but I'm going to put everything together um, because they were ordered pretty close together. This took a really long time to come. I'm wondering if it's because it was so thick. And this took no time at all to come easy peasy couple of days but so christy is a ready to ship shop and she ships out her orders every single monday so if you ordered on a sunday pretty much your order would go out on the monday or um if you ordered on the thursday it would go out the next monday but she would start packing it immediately so you don't have like a two to three week processing time it's always usually a week and then whatever your local mail system is um let's get the small things all together and then I will do everything else that's in here. So, oh man. And uh, she had tiered freebies for her sale as well. So I might just start with those and then we'll go into like the big stuff that I ordered. So first off, um, if you ordered during these times, you get an Olivia that says 2024. It's cute. It's on matte paper. It's kiss cut. And I am going to put that into my boudreau. And because I have two, I'm also going to put it into my planner just to decorate that front page a little bit. And Olivia is just peeking up the side very cute. I'm having a hard time with the fact that it's 2024 because I'm still stuck in like 2019. <laughs> but um, we'll get there. Obviously, as I said, we get the beautiful little vinyl with the name on it. And it's all sparkly and glittery. So nice. Then uh, the freebies. So this is your November freebie. Christy changes it up every single month. So as you guys know, every single one of these Olivia, <gasps> she changed the font. It was twirly font here for a while, and then it was brush font. She changed it to this clean font. Oh my gosh, Christy, I don't know if you watch my videos. I hope that you do. I love this font. Um, I should say, if you guys don't know, Christy took down a lot of her, like, different words and, like, to-dos, to-cleans, whatever, scripts in her shop. She now has one custom listing available, and it has 14 different fonts that you can choose from, and it has, like, 10 really common ones, but you can also do a custom font. Obviously, that takes a little bit longer because it's custom to you. It's not as quick, but her turnaround is still typically, like, a week. So something to consider. Um, look at this beautiful Christmas tree and then the deco to go with it. Oh, just 
stunning. And then we've got a little Christmas cupcake, a little reindeer, a turkey, um, Olivia baking, Olivia wrapping presents. That's perfect. A little snowflake, a little present here. And then Christie's always cup of tea. This was, I think, one of the freebies from the sale. I think this was the $25 freebie, I want to say. Um, it's cute. It's cute. Am I going to use it? Probably not. Let's be real. So this might get into a gifted pile. Uh, and then there was just some stuff that I ordered. And then you got, and we'll get into that in a sec. Then you got the freebie for the $75 so this was the $50 freebie and it's just cute little deco holiday deco this is cuter I might use this I'm actually you know what this might look really cute with the oh should I do a leftover Christmas kit huh that might be something to consider let me know in the comments down below what you guys think because like think about it we've got this and then we've got this oh god let me know what you think in the comments down below. Uh, and then this was a $75 freebie, which is just um, a mini kit. So she has essentials kits, mini kits, and Hobonichi kits. Uh, and, oh, and bullet journaling kits now. So uh, I always order the essentials that work, what works best for my planning style. Um, but obviously go check out the shop, see what works well for you. So the mini kit has four full boxes. Then it has your um, six half boxes as well as eight checklist, a little weekend banner, and your little checkoff dots, which I really like. Then it comes with another eight um, third boxes, your deco, and this is the standard deco that you get in every kit. And then finally, it has some date covers as well as your sidebar, which I just think is really unique and like very good. So you've got your main bulk of your planner if that's how you plan for like very functional stuff and this is like all the extra deco that you can bring in so I really like that uh then I've got the freebie again because I melded these two together and more of this deco okay and okay so let's just do the little stuff that I bought first because that's sort of the more important stuff so first off, I actually went ahead and cleaned my makeup brushes, finally. So I have a reason to get this. And also, this is super cute. And um, every time I see it, it is going to remind me to clean my makeup brushes, um, which I do at an appallingly, like, I don't do it enough. I'm aware of that. So I know. I know, guys. I'm aware. Okay? So I've got the makeup brushes. I just had to reload on these filming slates and I think she actually made them smaller. So I'm really excited. You get one, two, three, four times one, two, three, four, five, six. So you get 30. Is that right? No, that's not right. Six times four. 24. Twenty-four. I don't know why I'm second guessing myself. I know math, okay? Kind of. You know what? We're not going to discuss my math problems. Okay? Okay? Calm down. Anyway, I needed more of these because I was running out of them. And also, I needed more of these. I know she made these smaller. That's so exciting. That's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 times 6. So that's that's 30. Oh, that's really exciting. I'm really thrilled. Then, uh, just a mop in a bucket. Um, I just needed this. And then just a check mark. I'm going to mark this for like work stuff that I have to mark or like when I just have stuff that I need to do. And um, you'll see it when you see my plan with me. But I think that this is going to be a really functional sticker for me. Um, I, have been, I have something similar like this in my paper and milk Maru. So yeah. Then just little shopping bags. I just use these for like when I go to the mall or something. And it's nice to have like a nondescript shopping bag. Because like I have cute ones from the Coffee Monsters Co. But they're Bath and Wadi Burks and Sephora. I just wanted something a little bit more neutral. Again, now that Christy has made these a tiny bit smaller, which I think I've been begging her for for like a year. Um, these are even so much more functional in my planner. And then I got some customs. So my kiddo has swim lessons. So she did two lines for me, you have to stipulate. So I got a couple sheets of that. And then my kiddo also, you know, it is the season, sick and swim. 
So just things that I wanted to mark down. And if you're going, hey, Alex, don't you have a little one too? I do have a little one. He already has his own custom scripts. I just um, didn't know if my big kid wanted to do some swimming lessons and he really did. So brought those in. Those are customs and I chose my font. So Christy didn't choose it for me. I chose it. I chose how I wanted it to look and um, what the layout was going to look like. So if you were wondering what custom, how customs work and she's really good. Christy uses Etsy communications, like their messaging center to go back and forth with you about whether or not like what you want. Then, um, my next, like she's thick, she's thick guys. She's thick. So first things first, I bought this. Um, and this is going to be for my 2024 kit lineup. Um, I usually buy these from the Prairie Planner, but Christy was coming out from them this year. And I was like, Oh, these are really nice. And they're quite small. Um, so these are just for the weeks of the year and I will just put them into my, um, album. So I'll pull it out for you actually. This is my album. And it already has some from the last few years. This is from the Prairie Planner. Um, I've already got some kits for next year. As you can see, like I originally did it by hand years ago. It doesn't come off, but like no one sees this but me. So it's fine. It's fine. It's all fine, guys. Um, so I'm going to go in and do all of my weeks here. I love the font that she's used. And I bought two of them. This one I might put in my Bujo TBD. I don't know yet. Okay. Next up, I decided to get her Christmas colorways. I just feel like I've got some really vibrant colorways, but I needed something a little bit more neutral. And I thought her winter ones, and I actually did, um, oh, she must have sent me this one extra because I definitely didn't order it a second time. Maybe I did? Possibly I did. Anyway, um, I just like the neutrals and I love the colors. And so I've got like habit trackers and um just a sheet of half boxes and then some sidebar i just feel like especially the greens will come in really like all of these colors are colors that are used pretty well year round so there's a lot that you can do with them i'm really excited so that's her winter colorway and i think that will be in the shop and she might change it up in january but you'd have to ask her specifically when she's going to change it but i definitely know that it's in the shop now uh, next up, this is a sneak peek. So Christy and I have been talking about books a lot. I am an avid reader since I was a kid. Um, loving the whole book talk, bookstagram trend, but I am like obsessed. And so Christy was showing me this deco and I was like, I need the deco. So she doesn't have a full kit with this because it didn't come with a full kit. It was just deco when you got it, but this will be added to the shop shortly. I'm sure it will be there for boxing or er, boxing day. The Boxing Day sale, but I already want to bring in my Simply Gilded Washi and make um, probably in March a full spread using this deco because these are um, a bit bigger than full boxes or the same size as full boxes, and you can just make this into a full spread and use the deco and use it that way. So I'm really excited for that as well. Um, then I bought um, one two, three kits, three kits. I've got three kits here. So I will go into the Christmas kit first because that's the one that I really, really wanted. And I decided this year, I don't want to have a full month of sweet tea. I don't want to have a full month of the Prairie Planner. I did want to have some variety for my Christmas kits. So I've got a printable, I've got the Prairie Planner, I've got sweet tea, and then I am going to do a leftovers and washi spread for Christmas as well. This one though, um, I want to use, I think, I don't know when I want to use this. I've got Christmas stuff every single week starting this week, so I don't know, um, but I'm really excited. It's called Tis the Season. It is still available in shop, and it is, like, very throwback, um, not Victorian, obviously, but, like, definitely an earlier place in time, or at least that's how the kit feels to me. I love the colors on camera. I love how vibrant they are. I love the browns. I love the greens. I love this taupe color, honestly hope is really nice. Uh, so let me walk you through the format of the kit and then I will show you the other two kits, but we don't have to walk through the format completely. So firstly, you always get eight full boxes and four habit trackers and two, um, 
half boxes. Then you get your super duper functional page, which I love. And so you get nine more half boxes, three patterned and six plain. And then you get these three flower checklists and then you get third boxes. So nine more and then you get five scallop boxes. My only criticism of these kits is that I think I would probably like two more scallop boxes so you could put one on every single day of the week. That being said, I don't really use the scallop boxes, so I don't know why I'm asking for more, you know? I don't know. Anyway, um, then you get your next functional page. These kits are just, I don't know. They work with my planning style. What can I say? I love the gingham. So you get your to-dos, your glitters, and your uh, deco headers. And this is just a nice gingham pattern, as well as your stackable sidebar, if that's something that you were interested in, your Monday through Sunday, a weekend banner. I love these little flags. Uh, this week for your sidebar, you guys know I have a thing. I love this. And then you get your I like this green gingham and the red gingham. And then so your date covers. And finally, the bottom washi. I like that she went simple. You probably could have gone um, a little bit more like crazy with it. But you have this green fur for the trees. Can you guys see that? Oh, it's really pretty. I really like it. And then and then a Christmas plaid at the bottom. You also get your deco and then your heart um, flower checklist and these inverted flags. And that's the whole kit. So I love this kit so much. It's so beautiful. I love it. Okay, next up, because we've got more kits to come. And this is long already. Guys, I'm sorry this is such a long haul. Let me know down in the comments below if you like a long haul or a short haul. I actually don't know. I try and keep them around like 20 minutes, but this is obviously longer than that. But like, again, let me know in the comments down below. Then I got Relax and Unwind, and this just screams France to me. My aunt's place, uh, my aunt lives in England, so she has a place in France. And um, this just looks a little bit like her place, specifically this and uh, this. This is almost identical to her place in France, and this, actually. Anyway, it's beautiful. Same format. Love the colors. Greens and browns. I don't know if you can tell. That's really what I've been going for recently. Then again, your functional page, your deco um, right here. Oh, and if there is deco related to a kit, it's always listed separately in the shop. I don't think I said that before. Then, oh my gosh, look at these headers. Look at your decorative. And if you don't want to use um, this as like headers, you can smoosh it together and it still makes a full box, obviously. And this is like, um, what is that? Tile on like a Spanish roof or a French roof. It just makes me really happy. And then this is the bottom washi. Now, I am not the biggest fan of the gingham for the bottom washi here. So I think... Um, I think I'll pull in, I've got like pretty perfect, um, simply gilded washi that would match this. Actually, uh, I never thought I would get this much use out of it, but the oat, it matches this kit perfectly. So I'll probably bring that in with this kit. Um, yeah. So that's called relax and rewind, unwind, unwind, not rewind, Alex. Oh my God. And then finally, last but not least, I did buy a, a winter kit, Hello Winter. I'm on the fence about this. I bought it because it's really beautiful, but I, do I have it already? Do I have this kit already? Did I rebuy this kit? No, she, I feel like this was a new release. Let's see. I've got this kit where I'm not sure where I'm putting it. Then I've got this Simply Ginger one that I don't love. Autumn, Easter, wait, what's after Autumn. No, nope, that's just the autumn kit. Then I've got Enjoy the Little Hangs. This boho kit I am super pumped for. And then just a baby kit. All right, no, I don't have this winter kit. If I don't have enough for my winter spreads, definitely this is what's going to be coming into it. Um, Hello Winter. Maybe I'll use it for like the first week in January. It just feels like a Bob Ross painting. I really love it. I really truly do. Anyway, uh, walk you through it again. It's just, it's just screaming January to me. So I'm going to use it in January. I'm just talking myself into it. I love it. Snow on the trees. And then look at this. I've never had like a glitter bottom washi before. And I love this. Again, 
Um, the frosted fur, oh, it doesn't, does it really match? Not really. Maybe there's a new one um, called Sweet Sage that's coming out because this is kind of greeny undertone. Sweet Sage is coming out. So maybe I'll use it with that. I don't know. I don't know. There's so many possibilities. I love this time of year because I get so into planning and I'm so excited for it again. But that was literally everything that I got from Sweet Tea Sticker Co. It's so much, but I've loved every single every single part of this. So, um, just a moment. So friends, that was everything, um, for my haul. Um, I, I'm so excited. I'm so happy. I'm so thrilled that I was able to share this with you. I really hope that you are staying safe and well. I hope that you are having a good day and, uh, I hope that I see you in my next video. Toodles.